Nothing's more annoying than slamming doors, whether it be against a skirting board or furniture. And even worse, when the handle puts a big hole in the wall. It's definitely not a good look. Well, there's a range of stops and catches out there that will prevent this from happening. And I'm going to show you two examples. The first one being the magnetic catch, and that's going to stop this door from slamming when the window's open. First thing to do when you're working with finished doors and skirting boards is to actually put some tape on. That way you're marking the tape and not marking all over the door. It just keeps everything nice and clean. Now with these magnetic catchers, I'm going to be using a 19mm spade bit to install it. I've just put some tape around for the depth that I need to drill to. Once the hole's done, I'll slip the magnet in and screw it off. Now for the other magnet, I'm just going to mark the edge of the door on the skirting board. That way I can transfer the measurements. There you go. This door won't be slamming anytime soon. That's one down, one to go. Ah! Oh, wrong door. <laughs> and the problem in here, well, the door hits up against the furniture. So to fix it, I'll be using a magnetic floor stop. The way it works, the base comes out, that gets fixed to the floor, slips over. On the other side, we attach this to the door. That way, the magnet grabs it. Now I've got a position for my door stop. To attach it, I take the cover off. And I'm left with the mounting plate. I'm just going to use a felt pen to mark that on the carpet. Then I'll drill and screw that off. Now in this case, we're working with carpet. So I can't go just drilling holes, because otherwise I'll pull a thread. So to prevent that from happening, I'm just going to cut a slot. No more damaged doors, because I'll put a stop to this. 